Hi, so in this video we are going to draw a circle which is actually not a circle, it is a polygon of large number of sides. So in this case I am going to draw a polygon of 360 sides which will look like a circle. And this is we are doing because in logo you cannot draw a curved line, you can draw only straight lines. So if I draw very very small straight lines along with the perimeter of the circle you will not be able to find whether they are straight line or curved lines right so this is what we are going to do using logo we are going to draw a very very tiny straight lines by changing the angle every time and that will look like a circle so what i'm going to do is i'm going to draw a polygon of 360 sides so first let me set the pen size as 3 3 this will be slightly thicker and we are doing this just to see the figure properly and then what I am going to do I am going to draw a polygon of 360 sides so I am going to do that using repeat command as we have learned in our last video so repeat 360 and what we are going to repeat we are going to do FD2 this will draw a line equal to 2 pixels or two tiny units or two tiny steps of the turtle and this we are going to achieve by doing right turn of one degree every time and if we turn by one degree every time 360 times it will make the right turn equal to 360 degrees and that is what the sum of exterior angle of a polygon is right so let's see what we get if I execute it yes we have got a circle we have got a circle which is actually a polygon of 360 sides and the side of the polygon are so small that you can hardly find them right so this is one way but it has a problem the problem is you cannot define the radius in this case so in next video we are going to learn how to draw a circle whose radius is given link of that video is given below you can click you can directly click to that link or you can search it in our channel and what if you want to draw a bigger circle if you want to draw a bigger circle you can increase the length of one side of the polygon so if I reset it we are at home and then if I increase the length of one side of the polygon if I make it 5 you will get a bigger circle which actually is not fitting in this window so I'll increase the size of this window and scroll it here and here and yes it is not visible properly right not a problem see some part of the circle is drawn over here this is the wrapping effect which I was talking about if you draw a line which is longer than it can fit in the window it actually draws it to the other side very similar to the map you see in your books if you see properly Alaska and Alaska which is in North America and few parts of Asia are actually 60 kilometers apart but when you see them in a map you, they seem very far off so this is actually the same effect so let me reset it but it brings a question if somehow we can shift the position of the turtle towards the left we can draw a full circle in one screen isn't it yes so let's try doing it so what we want to do we want to shift the turtle towards its left but the turtle can go only in the direction of its head so first we have to turn the turtle towards the left so I'll do LT 90 this will turn the turtle towards left and then we have to move it by suppose 300 points so FD 300 but it draws a line so it doesn't serve our purpose so what we have to do for this is we have to do pen up if we do pen up the turtle stops drawing so now if I do LT 90 it will turn towards left and if I move it by 300 points it will move 300 points towards left without drawing anything right and now what we have to do we have to 
turn it again by 90 degree RT90 to make it pointing upwards right so we have shifted our turtle successfully towards the left of the window right and now we have to draw but this turtle is not drawing so to make it draw again I will do pen down so pen down so this will again put the turtle on the job and now if I draw that circle which was this one right this one and execute it yes it has come in the same window but we have to expand this window to see it properly so this is the upper part and this is the lower part now you can see this circle somewhat properly so this was a bigger circle and here we have taken one side as equal to five points and here also you can hardly find out any straight line in the circle right so this is the way we can draw a circle and in next video we are going to learn to draw a circle whose radius is given because in this case we don't know the radius or the diameter of the circle so in next video we are going to learn to draw a circle whose radius is known right so bye bye till then